Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another Sunday Live activation. Today, we are going to be doing a Pleiadian activation and Kundalini. <laughs> Let me give me a thumbs up if you guys can hear me okay. And if you're here right now watching, please give this video a like. Sending love. Hello, everybody. So what I'm going to do is just chat a little bit about Kundalini. And the Pleiadians are here with us. So we will invite them. I will be channeling those frequencies and helping to activate the Kundalini energy. Okay, you guys can hear me perfect. And a couple announcements first before we get in. Um, well, let me shout out. Is Berwin Bravo here? Let me share my screen. And wait, where's the screen share? Okay, maybe not. Okay, maybe we'll do that later. I don't know where the screen share button is. Okay. Well, I wanted to shout out some Starseed merch. So I'll, I'll show you guys next time. But thank you so much for sending me your photos of the Starseed merch. You guys look freaking awesome. And if you'd like to get any Starseed merch, you can do so at lilynovaspaceart.com. Thank you, Logan, for the super sticker. Awesome. And we have Hopewell Farms here. One of the announcements. If you guys are interested in trying CBD or looking for a new CBD supplier, Hopewell Farms is who I go through. It's a lovely starseed couple. They make all of this themselves. They do energy work on it. And so you can get 10% off anything in the store in the link in the description. It helps me with meditation. It helps with it just a lot of health overall in general. So hi, Alex McCarthy. How's it going? Are you ready for your Kundalini awakening? <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Thank you, Victor, for sharing that. So Hopewell Farms, 10% off, link in the description. And so I guess I'll go into the Kundalini. It's been a while since we've talked about the Pleiadians. And they actually woke me up this morning to give blessings and show support for the activation today. I was like just in a deep sleep and then suddenly I had this intense dream that just like jolted me awake and I looked over, you know how I've been sharing that I can, I'm beginning to see them more. Like you guys have heard, there's a portal in this house and it's helping me to be able to see them more with my own eyes. And so I jolted awake and I looked over at the wall and there's a group of Pleiadians there. <laughs> which the Pleiadians are one of the most kind of common star origins. The Pleiadians are an advanced civilization, advanced beings. They are like our older brothers and sisters. They look very, very human. They just have blonde hair and blue eyes typically. So they're very compassionate, very loving. Every time I see them, like I want to cry because they're just so high vibrational. And they're really, really into the just balancing your energy. So the Kundalini energy is energy going throughout your body. And a lot of it is dormant. Thank you guys for the uh, super stickers, Gypsy and Tony. So a lot of this Kundalini energy is dormant. If you have a problem or if there is something that you are struggling with, in this physical world, it comes down to energy. Everything is energy. And we have multiple chakra systems. There's seven famous ones, well-known ones. And then there is, well, I think there's like 112 or 114 chakras. So there, there's those seven main ones. And then we have a bunch. And a lot of it is dormant. A lot of it can get blocked or kicked off balance and that will manifest things in your physical world like if you're having intimacy issues or have issues with creativity that is your 
sacral chakra down by your navel. If you feel too much in your mind, racing thoughts, anxiety, and even fear, stress, worry, fear, not feeling stable, that is an imbalance in your root chakra, which is down near the base of your spine. So there's a lot of energy that in a lot of these energy centers that are actually dormant. And doing a little bit of digging on kundalini energy and kundalini awakening, it's very powerful. And doing a kundalini awakening, which you want to do it at a slower pace. <laughs> so we will set the intention right now that, you know, we get from this what we can handle and for the highest good of all. It can be a process. Some people have spontaneous awakenings. I remember I had a spontaneous kundalini awakening. I was out stargazing. I was laying down. It was a meteor shower. And I started meditating for a minute. And then suddenly I just felt this burst of energy. And I began receiving all of these crazy visions. My consciousness expanded. And it was just really intense. <laughs> and the kundalini energy... It can happen at a slower process too, which is probably healthier. But the kundalini awakening helps you to move energy through your body efficiently and it helps balance your complete life. A kundalini awakening and a kundalini meditation activation like we will be doing in just a minute can change your life within days. You can become a different person, which is pretty cool. So that will help us tap into unrealized potential. And you will not have any more worries. Things just start coming together. You see things from a bigger perspective. And everything just begins to work out, you know, to, to your highest good. Hello, everybody. Oh, I also wanted to make an announcement. that. So I'm leaving town for a spiritual informers conference, I believe in Orlando, Florida. That is October 21st through 23rd. Let me know if any of you guys are going to be there. I would love to meet up. I'm going with Savita, the Starseed, um, Robert White, who was on Starseed chats last week is going to be there. So we're going to be collaborating, but so I'm leaving town. So for the next two weeks, there will not be a live activation. I also need to finish setting up my studio, getting rid of like the echo and all of that and start recording more content. So the next two weeks, there will not be a live activation. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to begin posting some of my older activations as standalone meditations. So you don't have to sit here through the live. And if you ever wanna go back to any of the activations um, you can just skip to the part where I pick up the singing bowl. Um, so yeah, next two weeks, <laughs> Robert's going. Yay. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited to see you. Superpower activate. Yeah, exactly. I know. I'm sorry guys. But what, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to post these, these other meditations at the exact same time on Sunday. So 2 PM central time. So even next weekend, you can come back and there will be a meditation for you. And you can, you guys can keep the routine going and do it at 2 p.m. together still, which is very powerful. And this Wednesday, we have Alicia, who actually she reached out to me through email. She's a member of the audience. And she sent me an email about this amazing experience she had through the Vega activation, which you can find on my channel. And she was sharing some things about how she's like channeling artwork and having these experiences. So I'm going to have like the first community chats this Wednesday. It will be live. It will be at eight o'clock PM central time. So we'll have Alicia here and she'll just share, you know, we're all going through this awakening together and we're all having probably experiences that may make you feel like crazy or like what's really going on. <laughs> We're having a lot of physical changes, mental, spiritual, 
and everybody's path is unique and different. So we'll explore channeling. She's been able, she's begun to channel these drawings and things like that. So we'll talk about channeling, channeling through art, and just kind of share some experiences. And it will be live so you guys can come hang out, interact with us. And I want it to be just like a really community hour for all of us to just kind of share and chat. Yeah, Leah, definitely go if you're close. Dan Heaton's going to be there. Awesome. Awesome. So let's see. Going back to the Kundalini energy. So basically it, it's, it's the life force that runs through your body and it opens you up to these other dimensions, which is why if it gets activated too quickly, like, you know, it could be really intense. So we want to do it in a gradual way. So this activation, which I'll start in just a minute, uh, will really help with that. But it's basically the life force energy. And the Pleiadians are really, really big on balancing. Like they always show me the snake through the chakras, which is basically symbolizing complete harmony and balance. And it makes your life way easier. It helps you tap into untapped potential. Things start working out for you. You become completely transformed and your awareness raises your connection to source, to these higher dimensional beings raises. And a lot of it's just already here. It's just dormant. So we'll be activating that. And apparently you, you only need to activate 21 chakras to live a, like a fulfilled life, a good balanced life, 21 out of the 114. So we'll work to get to that 21 today. And you will never experience inadequacy. You will just feel better. You will feel adequate. You will feel more confident, uh, more aligned with yourself. And yeah, I guess that's about it. That is about it. Um, also, if you want to sign up for the DNA activation kits, you can do so with the link in the description or for one on one sessions. I will be opening those near the end of October. Are you guys ready? Today, I have the throat chakra bowl, which I'm super excited for. And don't forget, if you guys are interested in CBD, there is, well, Hopewell Farms put a 15% off uh, code in the chat or you can go to the description all right guys everybody hydrate <laughs> we're gonna be channeling a lot of energy this is the throat chakra bowl it works specifically with the throat chakra, but it also opens and balances all of your other chakras. And the throat chakra is a really important piece of connecting to source and to higher realms. So they wanted me to use the throat chakra bowl today. All right, everybody hydrate. Begin in a relaxed position. Start taking a few deep breaths in. Breathing the life force energy into your body. You may even visualize or see this life force energy entering in through your mouth and spreading throughout your body filling you with love filling you with light and we also want to make sure that we are firmly grounded in order to stabilize these energies So visualize a platinum light it 
starting up in the heavens, in space, in higher realms, the grand central sun, direct link to source, this platinum light comes down through space, down from the sun, down through the sky, down into your roof, entering into your room, entering into the crown chakra and the other chakras above the head, which is basically like plugging you into source, into the infinite. This platinum energy goes down through your crown down through the rest of the chakras in your body and then we'll focus on the root chakra for a second and the earth star chakra below your feet this chakra helps keep you grounded connects you with the earth with the earth is full of just harmonizing, balancing, cleansing energies. So this platinum light continues down through the root, down through your earth star chakra, and then deep into the earth. Down to the center of the earth, anchoring you in Stabilizing your body, your energy. Opening up to receive these healing, balancing, and activating frequencies. Plugging us into the 5D grid of the earth. And anchoring us there. Breathing in and out slowly. And now that we are firmly grounded, stable, strong, sturdy like a mountain on the earth, as well as plugged into higher realms through our crown, Now you have raised your vibration enough to visit the Pleiadians. Visualize a mountain. Visualize a beautiful mountain and we are all transported there together, all of us doing this activation sitting on this mountain top. Seeing land stretch, flowers, beautiful green, beautiful colors all around you. Sitting there,
And on this mountain, we are joined by a group of Pleiadians. They may appear as illuminated beings, blonde hair, blue eyes, fair skin. They may be wearing white clothing. Some may be in blue suits. There's a group of Pleiadians here to assist us in the activation of our Kundalini energy, helping us to bring this life force that runs throughout the whole universe through our body, activating our other chakras, Feel the love and compassion of these beings, of our teachers. As we all sit in a group, and also to assist in receiving this help. We will focus on our heart for a moment. As our heart is also a portal. Feeling your heart fill with love. Opening your heart to receive this assistance. becoming heart-centered. Now as we all sit here in a group with our Pleiadian guides, these beings step forward and begin instructing us, showing us how to work the Kundalini energy, the life force energy that runs through all of us. Just visualizing and feeling whatever comes to mind. As these Pleiadians begin showing us how to activate our dormant energy. You may begin seeing this platinum energy begin coming up through your lower chakras activating dormant chakras as it is for your highest good focus your point below your feet and begin to feel this energy coming up. Through all of these little energy centers all over your body, there may be some that are dim or dull and now they begin to light up and fill with life. The Pleiadians guiding us with technique.
also teaching us how to use this energy. Feel it coming up through your body, starting from the bottom. This platinum energy, this platinum light, pure life force, stimulating the chakras, going up to your root chakra at the base of your spine and all of the chakras around it, inside and outside of your body. Visualize and feel this life force begin activating them. This energy and platinum light begins crawling up in almost like a snake-like fashion up through your sacral by your navel and the surrounding energy centers. Up to your solar plexus and its surrounding energy centers. Inside and outside of your body begins to light up and fill with this life force energy. This platinum energy continues up into your heart and the surrounding chakras, filling your entire body and the bodies around your body, the non-physical energy bodies. You really begin to see and feel all of these additional chakra centers that you had no idea existed. They've been dormant for a long time. They begin to awaken. Going up through your heart, filling your torso, all around your torso, up to your throat, The throat also helps you connect with the divine. So we'll pay extra attention to the throat chakra and surrounding chakras. Allowing this life force energy through, harmonizing and balancing, activating, awakening, Feel this chakra begin to brighten and all of the ones around it begin to come alive. This kundalini energy continues up and enters into your third eye. This platinum energy, this life force energy, continuing its climb up in a snake-like manner, filling your head, filling all of the energy centers around your head, entering into your third eye. Focus on that spot in the middle of your forehead. Feel it full. This is awakening you to higher realms, higher dimensions, in a healthy and balanced way. Going up to your crown chakra, the chakras above your head, filling them with this life force energy, awakening and activating any other energy centers that can be awakened and activated at this time. See yourself sitting with this 
platinum kundalini energy coming up through your entire body, pumping you with life, activating wonderful things that you could have never imagined for yourself. As this life force energy flows through our body, this kundalini awakening, we become balanced, we become more powerful. We access parts of our mind higher levels of consciousness, understanding, awareness. And just sit here for a moment and be aware of this kundalini energy, this life force flowing through your body. You may feel it flow through like, like a breeze or like wind. Could be another sensation. Feel it traveling up. Feel yourself energized, balanced. This will transform you will transform your life. You feel powerful. You feel awareness. You feel like you can direct these energies in a way that is most beneficial for you and others. With this kundalini energy activated in a healthy and balanced way, you will now experience great success in life. You can now dance and play with the universe energetically. Wonderful things will begin to just come to you. You now really feel a deeper connection with life, with source. Breathing this life force in, circling throughout your body and around your body. Just take a moment to appreciate it and feel it. The Pleiadians are proud of us. They give us a little round of applause for achieving this next step in our ascension, in our awakening. And we ask that our guides, our cosmic families, continue to help teach us how to use, activate, and direct this precious life force energy. Raising our awareness, our understanding, our compassion for others and life. Now ground this energy deep into your being, allowing it to flow freely, balanced and harmonious. But ground this deep into you and watch your life transform. (laughs) 
Over the coming days, blessings will come to you. You will live through life with more ease and balance and are beginning to understand how to really direct this powerful life, life force energy. Sending love and gratitude to the Pleiadians, to our guides, to Source, everyone here on this mountain with us. And you may now begin coming back, bringing your awareness to this present moment. You can come back to this meditation anytime you would like. This is a process. Sending love, gratitude, and many thanks. And then... You may want to wiggle your fingers, your toes, open your eyes when you're ready, and let me know how you feel. Ooh la la. Wow. <laughs> Gypsy, wow. Victor says he feels like he's floating in an energy bubble. Me too. <laughs> kind of feel like, like, yeah, just very free flowing, relaxed, very aware, intentional. My ear just started ringing. <laughs> We've got family nearby. Alicia says she feels this everywhere. And Alicia's coming on Wednesday. So make sure if you guys can make the live Wednesday at 8 p.m. Central. And yeah, beautiful. And if you guys are watching the replay or here right now, please give this video a thumbs up. And let me know in the comments how your experience went. Blissful, happy, grateful, Jennifer, <laughs> Fernando, fabulous, thank you, Libby for the rejuvenating kundalini, beautiful, aw, Tony, wow, I felt so much love, I burst into tears, that's amazing, I cannot wait to do a reading with you next week, yeah, Charlene, feeling like floating, beautiful, um, Jason, do you use Kundalini the same way Reiki? I believe similar. I'm very intuitive with this. I just go where I'm guided. I've never been, I never took any certifications for Reiki. The star beings taught me and I just go with it. <laughs> so it can also be a very intuitive process. But I know there are other Kundalini exercises you could do if you are interested in working on that more. There's a Kundalini yoga and probably a bunch of other things that you could try. I'll have to look into that. Oh, kept yawning. <laughs> Got you relaxed, huh? Oh, I always feel the quickening when I do your meditations. Awesome. Crown chakra tingling. Beautiful. Awesome. Thank you guys so much. And yeah, awesome. I'm so glad everybody had such a had a beautiful experience. Um, also, if you would like to donate or support this channel, and I'm getting like panels to put up around the studio for no echo. And really, that's the next big focus is, you know, bumping that up. So if you guys would like to donate or, you know, just leave a tip, you can do so with the donate link in the description. 
Again, there is 10% off CBD in the description and Star Seed merch at lilynovaspaceheart.com. Thank you guys. I hope you enjoy the rest of your Sunday. I will be live Wednesday, like I said. But yeah, there two weeks off of live activations. But like I said, I'll be posting a, a standalone one um, on Sunday. So you could still come back and do that. Ah, uh, Guardian, I was going to share your picture. I don't know why, like my, I can't find my screen share right now. But they bought some hoodies, some Arcturian hoodies, and they look phenomenal on them. So I'm going to show you guys next time. I'm going to make a collage, a little montage video. So thank you so much. They looked great on you. Oh, okay. Awesome, guys. Thank you so much. Enjoy the rest of your Sunday. I will hopefully see you on Wednesday. Bye, guys. I love you.